Hi and welcome to my channel. My name is David. Today I'm going to do an unboxing of uh, HP's uh, accelerator, graphic accelerator. It's uh, the Omen uh, GA1-110NA model. And it's uh, Thunderbolt enabled, so I will also check if it can connect to my HP Spectre X360 13 inch. So let's uh, do the unboxing. It's a very large box, so hmm, let's see what it contains. So here we have it's a uh, Thunderbolt cable that should be in included in the box. Uh, this is a strange packaging. Um, some kind of sack holding the, the, the HP Omen accelerator. Let's see if I can get it out with one hand. So here it is. Wow, this is a big device. I bought this because uh, it has features that uh, the Razer Core doesn't have. It, you can have an uh, external hard drive in this also. And that I miss with the Razer Core. Otherwise it uh, should have the same functionality uh, regarding ports and uh, other other things but let's see what uh, what we have here so there's a comparison between the two devices you can see the racer core is quite small not only in the width uh, it's uh, also a lot thicker as you can see it's almost two times three two and a half times as uh, wide as the uh, as the racer core so uh, i'm going to try to install uh, my graphic card and uh, and hard drive inside also so let's move on so let's open the device up let's see what uh, what we have here there's a spring loaded uh, device there that you can switch it aside and now it's only to remove the cover side so there's a 500 watt uh, power supply here and uh, you can see it is connected to the motherboard and uh, down here we have the let's uh, see if I can move a little bit closer the PCIe slot for the graphic card and it should uh, fit uh, most graphic cards I think but uh, you have to check with HP of course before buying and uh, here's uh, the plate where you uh, connect uh, your hard drive and there's the cable to the to the hard drive also so everything is in place so let's move on with the installation so now I set in the graphic card it was quite easy it's just uh, to remove a screw and uh, uh, loosen the screw and, and then install and uh, it, the drive was a little bit more tricky 
can see there's a screw hole that you fasten the graphic card with. And on this, this short side you can see the, the ports. We have uh, quite a lot of ports. It's uh, almost the same. Uh, it's the same as uh, the yeah. Razer Core. You have uh, this is a LAN port and a Thunderbolt port, and you have four USB uh, 3.0 ports also. So that's uh, more or less equal to the to the Razer Core. Okay. Let's uh, check, uh, put in the cables and see if we can connect it. Let's connect the Thunderbolt cable here and see. If uh, what happens? And you can see it uh, start glowing. But uh, so let's check uh, if we have a connection here. Okay, only the NVIDIA symbol is there. Let's see. Okay, it's uh, the 1070 graphic card is in active. I haven't rebooted the PC after this installation. So I think it's best, best to do a, a reboot first. booting up so let's check the Thunderbolt uh, software I saw something glimpsing by there before it, uh, the settings uh, was uh, active, so it did something at least. But here you can see I have no connection at all. Let's try to reconnect again. But, uh, nothing happens. Ah, this is uh, not good. I was thinking that HP's connection should be very stable because both are HP pro products. So, but uh, this is disappointing. You can see it's glowing, uh, but uh, I get no connection at all. Let's check so that I so that I have the right. Con connection active okay I think we have to go into the device manager and uh, see if uh, and see if we can activate the device uh, from from the device manager there should be two display adapters uh, but you can only see the the built-in one so something is very strange here and I think I have to return this uh, device or at least uh, try to reach the support and see if they can help me. Please subscribe, it would really help me to develop my channel. And thank you very much for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you, bye bye.